The world is full of energy. One element impacts another, and together, they form the world around us. There needs to be equilibrium, or at least a semblance of it in time. You are part of this vortex of life. Envira is a clever and fast strategy board game with simultaneous player action. It's a game of wits where you'll compete to capture tiles worth varying points. You'll be attempting to maximize your points by capturing higher valued tiles and collecting specific sets worth bonus points. You're trying to score the most points by collecting tiles and grouping them in sets of the same theme, which is the colors. Some tiles have points on them directly, but you'll also get a 2, 4, or 7 point bonus for having 2, 3, or 4 different symbols on the tiles in those sets. To gather these tiles, you'll be simultaneously with others deciding which tiles you'll be trying to capture. This is done by secretly placing one or two cubes on the player grid corresponding to the tiles in the playing area. Then everyone will reveal their plans. The cubes are then placed on the tiles of interest in a serpentine player order with the first player also placing the last cube. But the order of which cube you place onto the corresponding tile is important, especially when there's a conflict with another player or even more players for that same tile, since if there is a tie for the amount of cubes, the player that placed last gets it. Sometimes you want to avoid placing your cube on the desired tile sooner than your opponent to avoid helping them to get the tile. Other times, you place the cube to distract your opponent or to set up a position for the next turn. Or you won't have a choice like the pink player here, since the other player outsmarted them this time. Turn order is essential, as you must plan a few turns ahead. With careful planning and good opponent assessment, you can use your fellow Bud's cubes to get your coveted tiles sooner. To complicate things even more, some tiles require tiles of other colors first, giving you opportunities for longer term planning. Even though you're trying to spread out and capture as many tiles as possible, you need to be careful not to have all your cubes in the grid at the beginning of the next round, like purple here, as all of them will come back to you with no tiles as any reward. The rules are simple, but the gameplay has plenty of depth and player interaction as it requires analyzing the situation and making proper tactical decisions quickly. You must anticipate your opponent's moves, otherwise you have no chance. You might need to sacrifice a certain tile to obtain another, which creates excruciating decisions. And Vira is for 2-4 players with a 5th player expansion available. It's a portable game with a small footprint and is language independent. It plays in only 20 minutes, is for ages 8 and up, and published by Rudy3 Publisher. Click the link below to get your copy today, as Envira is a rare-to-find game printed in very limited quantities, and it's not available in general retail chains. In this campaign, Envira comes with the Equilibrium expansion, where points can now be earned by meeting the requirements on the Equilibrium card. Finally, it also comes with the mini Easter promo tiles, making gray, high point tiles easier to get with more players, thus creating greater competition later in the game.